Hey Simleys, it's Delicracy here with my Twins LP makeover. I've just had two of the babies, uh, Esmeralda Shamwows and Niles Butler. Their babies actually age up to little kids, so I need to put them in some clothes, make them look nice. I also cut Laurie's hair in the last part, but I know you guys uh, often ask to see the transformation videos or the makeover videos when Sims do age up from the LP, so I thought I'd just do a quick video and you can join me doing it. So anyways, we have uh, Max and Thorn. They are twins, but they're definitely not identical twins. They look quite different. Um, Thorn here is really cute. He's got kind of chubby little cheeks. And then uh, Thorn is obviously quite different looking, a bit more tanned, darker hair, and he's going to be more of a music kid. Whilst the other one's evil. <laughs> so let's get Thorn some hair to begin with. He could wear a hat. Uh, we could put him in like a beanie cap or something like that. But I don't think that really suits him. I think I'd prefer... I mean, that's pretty cool. An evil person would totally wear that. <laughs> I don't know. Is there an evil bear version? I mean, that one's kind of different face expression. Um, nah, I, don't, I, I just don't think that's really worth it. We could do this hair. Young, longer kid hair, the, the evil comb over. Feeling like we do the evil comb over. Um, not saying little kids with comb overs are evil by any means. Don't get that wrong. But I thought that could be kind of cute. Ooh, we could have like an earring. Nah, I don't think we'll do that just yet. These glasses are awesome. I did not see these with the Get to Work expansion. They are so cool. And I really want to use them. He can be like a little evil nerd, like the loner outcast kid that no one really talks to and then becomes evil because of it. Uh, yes. So we will do that. What are these? These are new too. Oh, they're cool. They're really nice glasses. Like they're actually really nice glasses. Maybe we should actually do those. Because uh, he does come from a really wealthy family, so he probably wouldn't be stuck with really nerdy glasses. Even though these look like really good quality, though. Like, they look like cool glasses. We'll go with these. Quite nice. And in terms of attire, we could go with... Hmm... Robots, because he's a little bit uh, on the more nerdy side. The monkey's so cute. I don't want him to necessarily be like your stereotypical evil, the kid that wears black and stuff. I think we'll make it a little less obvious, but he will be perhaps a little bit lonerish. That's a cute top. Oh, he could wear this. I love this collared shirt. I tried to put this in my Barbie LP, but most people were like, ah, uh, no. <laughs> so uh, I'm thinking of a stripey top. I don't mind the stripes. I wish these glasses were all black now, though. You could have red glasses to match a stripy top. That's kind of cool. And then for the pants, we will go with um, not ripped pants. I think Lionel would really want him to have ripped pants because Lionel thinks they're his kids. Uh, if you haven't been watching the LP, whereas so Lionel thinks they're his kids, but Niles the butler, who's a real father, he and Esmeralda have a plan to get all of Lionel's money and the twins are going to find out about it. That's pretty much what's happening in the LP at the moment. Uh, so it's been heaps of fun and very, uh, well, very much drama filled. Maybe just some nice black sh Connie shoes or these. Yeah, not those. They're, they're a little serious. Way so serious. Let's put those shoes on him. Oh, brown ones could be nice. Yeah, let's go little brown ones. He's cute. I like this kid's look. He's looking cool. Alrighty. Um, we should give him a secondary everyday look. And for that look, we could go with... Oh, he has a love heart on his shirt. I think we might go with just a plain... No, no, no. What about cardigan and top? It's not bad. It's not bad, it's not that good. Red could be his favourite colour. Well, we better mix it up a bit more than red. Um, maybe we have some bright pants. Red pants. Okay, his favourite colour is red. Awesome, we'll just go with those two clothes uh, for this one. Why has he got those earrings on? I'm not a fan. 
of that right now. You can have these. His typical red glasses, signature red glasses on. And I would rather him have like a full on, <laughs> full on alien suit. What? Is that glitched? The skin coming through there? Or is that how it's meant to be? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, we'll just go with the black suit. Nice shoes. Athletic. We probably won't see that much. Although he should have something. I don't think he'll be the type of sim to work out that often, but we'll just put him in something decent anyway, or half decent. Get him some black and white runners. I think we'll get rid of the bunny slippers and he can have... I would love a full body flannelette suit, but I don't think that's going to happen. He could have this one. What's this? He could have a hatching monster egg on his pajamas because he'd be so into that. And black pants. <laughs> Hot dog head for the parties? Uh, I don't think so. This is cool, him in purple pants. I kind of rate that. Uh, but he'll need to have some different shoes on. I quite like it with his odd socks. He's a bit funny. Bit of a funny kid. And swimwear will just take off his top and he can have little bodies maybe in a red colour because he likes red. Uh, we got no reds. We'll just do blue then. Excellent. So that is uh, Thorn Lofton for you. Oh, what? What happened to the other outfit? Did oh, no. I Sorry, I really dupped that, didn't I? Uh, what, what was it? What do we have him in? We had a... Oh my gosh, I've had the biggest memory blank. We had him... What was he wearing? The robot top? No. He was wearing... Yes, robot top? I can't remember! <laughs> I've totally forgotten! Well, he was wearing black pants, I know that. Back, back in black. Which black pants were they? They had blue on the bottom, that's right. He had those little shoes on. That's so embarrassing, I can't remember what he was wearing. Oh dear. Well, we'll keep him in the robo top, because I like that. Uh, okay, or well, maybe that's what we did have, I don't know. Anyways, so he's done, let's move on to Max Lofton. Uh, okay, so... I did actually change their look slightly. That's why we're in full Kaz edit mode because I wanted his eyebrows to be slightly more angled to appear more evil. Um, so Max Lofton, so he's a bit of a whiz kid. He wants to be a musician. So maybe he's already getting into kind of looking a little bit trendy. Uh, what, what would be trendy for this little guy? Uh... <laughs> Freezer buddy top. Pretty cool. I don't know. I think just a plain top would be ideal. Like a plain plain back black t-shirt and some ripped jeans. Maybe the lighter ones. Light ripped jeans. White ripped jeans. Yeah, we'll go dark ones so he can be a bit of a cool cat. He can have shiny shoes too. Working up to being a muso. Maybe, was there something with a guitar on it? No. He could wear this though. Do we have any rolled up pants here? Not really. This could be another one of his outfits. Awesome shoes, by the way. Love those. They're so cool. We should wear them without other... Oh no, they're the same ones we just had. Cool. Formal wear. Uh, we might just put him in a matching suit to his brother so they can be like matching twins. If you are a twin and you're watching this and you're an identical twin or the same sex as your other twin, do you, did your parents used to dress you up in the same outfits and did that drive you crazy? Or did you actually think when you look back on it, oh, that was kind of cute. I can see why they did that. Uh, I would like to know. He can wear these big sporty sport, sport shorty shorts. <laughs> he can be a basketballer and uh, we'll get rid of these slippers. I'm not really feeling them. He can just have trackies. Go to bed in that. Um, and then we'll have... His top's looking a little bit girly on him for a party. Yeah. Maybe he can wear this. Black 
pants and then we'll put those cool shoes back on. Which ones were they? These ones? Yeah, I like those shoes a lot. Um, get rid of that. What other shapes do we have on these? Yeah, I'm not really feeling those. We'll go this with the prints on them. He's got a bit of a trendy necklace on. <laughs> get rid of that. Uh, thongs, do we want them? I don't think so. I don't think we really need them, to be honest. Okay, Niles is always the same because he's a butler. Uh, Laurie, I'm pretty happy with Laurie's outfits. They're, like, she's got quite a few to choose from. A couple cover up her sleeve, a couple show the sleeve, so that's all good. Lionel. <laughs> Lionel, but we call him Lionel. has got some nice clothes. And Arya, I think, is looking really good. Uh, some people in the LP said her legs were too big, and I'm like, I love her legs. I love that she's, like, shapely. I think she looks good. Not at all even close to being overweight. A few people said to get rid of her glasses, but I quite like the um, the glasses look on her, and I love this dress. But I suppose she could wear contacts sometimes, so maybe we could go with no glasses in this first outfit. And then she can just wear glasses when she wears this, because that looks cute. And this. Mm, we could take off those glasses too. She got some contacts for half the time. Uh, formal's all good. Sleepwear's all good. She should actually wear her glasses to sleep, shouldn't she? That would make more sense. Okay. Uh, and then that leaves us with Esmeralda. And Esmeralda's... She's interesting because she, she's recently come across all this extra money. So she wants to dress quite glamorous. Mm, she could wear this dress. Ooh, that's pretty cool, actually. I like that. And because she was a maid, she did have this signature look of wearing stockings. So half the time I'm thinking I want to continue that as a nod to a maid past having fishnets, which is, in case you don't know, a very, very stereotypical and stylized maid look. Um, oh, and also a few of you guys wanted her to get breast implants. So <laughs> we might just extend, make these a little bit bigger. So she had some work done. Should she go for a yucky breast implant job or a, a nice, uh, a more modest one? Ah. God, they just don't look right on her, do they? It's hard to... I guess if we do it in this dress, it's not as noticeable. Can we make her stomach come out a little bit to suit them? Okay, I mean, they're, they're obviously bigger than they were, so she's had a little bit of work done, which I think is looking quite good. We might put the fishnets under this outfit for some fun. There we go. And the third outfit. Could we improve this at all? Could we maybe... What's the flesh and the black one like? I don't mind that, the red and the black. She, she loves the colour red. Uh, we do know that. And she could wear her hair up sometimes. In the original bun we had, all the buns to the side. Um, not many similes actually liked the original bun I had. Which was... Mm -hmm. I thought this looked... Uh, not that one. Where is it? Uh, I don't even know where it's gone now. Oh, this one. I just kind of saw that as a posh bun on top of her head. But we could go with this look. Or like a big hair. Big hair could be cool. Some of our outfits. Which one? I think we'll go with this because uh, Jean, who Lionel sees, has... The, the other one. Maybe we can have one more outfit. Mm, we could go with either a dress or she could wear a really... No, that makes her look like a maid again. She would never want to wear maid, anything close to a maid outfit ever again. What about this? This is kind of edging towards Chanel. Of a jacket, the raglan tee. No, 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 no. Oh, this is very Chanel. 
she probably wants to get her hands onto some sh some Chanel ASAP. But she's a little bit more risque the way she dresses than she is dressing here. Well, <laughs> um, I just, these are all just a little bit too dressy. I'm just not feeling, is it particularly working? Maybe this one. I mean, this one's, this one's quite nice. Ah. She looks really good in electric blue, actually. That looks pretty cool as well. Or there's a typical red that she seems to always wear. I might do the electric blue because I think that looks so good on her. And we could go a nude heel if we want to. Now nah, we'll keep it as black. We'll put some earrings on. Uh, we'll get rid of the necklace but have earrings. Be these drop down ones. Excellent. Okay, well, that's all for this video. I hope you guys are having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. And I look forward to speaking with you soon. Bye.